Hey guys, how's it going? We're back in the lovely 100% bug free, no glitches involved, totally blizz like world of Ashran. I'm actually above little level 20. I've put blood, sweat, and tears into getting to this level. And, um, it sucks. It's terrible. I'm not looking forward to higher levels. But we're gonna do some quests anyway. And as you know, we're on, this time, we're on Tupac, my mage. Tupac the mage. Because Carhartt's in leather, motherfuck the weather. That wasn't even a Tupac quote, that was an Apache quote. Be careful. Um, I pimped out my UI. Uh, this is, this, I'll, I guess I'll start with my UI, I guess. Um, up here we have Mogget. This is just for, um, transmogging purposes. You could... Do any type of thing you want, and then you go ahead, and it shows you all the stuff you can mog. Um, it's not showing a lot of stuff for me right now because it only shows what you can get at your level. Since I'm only level 21, it only shows stuff I can get at level 21. And then I just have an old version of Atlas loot, just have Atlas loot. Um, Pitbull unit frames, so these fancy smancy unit frames are from Pitbull. We have dominoes for the action bars and such. And we have bag bag on or bag non. I forget. Where are we going? Alright, let's go kill some Morgan. Probably die in the process. And then I have scrolling battle text, which just happened right there. That's scrolling battle text. And it plays little clicks, too. So that's what the clicking is. Uh, I went Frost Mage because, um, you know, I have my little Water Elemental, my little buddy, and um, that sucked. God, I'm too pro for this. And I was, and if you're wondering why he's just punching the spider, it's because his auto cast is broken at the moment. And uh, I'm not gonna s sit there and click or set up a keybind. Because apparently you have to have keybinds for everything in this game, or you just shouldn't play the game and then uninstall it. Check. Yeah. No. We don't need strength and agility. Don't need that. Don't need this cluttering my bags. But yeah, the crane, this game, man. You know what? I, I was too hard on this game. You know, in the beginning. This game... You know what they're doing it's great. You know I'm you know, I'm having fun, having getting my ass beat. Hundred and nineteen damage a second from this worgen. You know, grinding up through quests. It's great, it's amazing. You know, I can't wait to be level one hundred so I can just AFK and Stormwind and do nothing. But yeah, the leveling's great. Fantastic. Couldn't love it anymore. Couldn't want it anymore. <laughs> Wouldn't want it any other way. Except the other way would be 100% Blizz like working. So, yeah, I guess I would want it that way. So, we're just gonna move into this Worgen territory. And then, I have another problem. And this is more of, this is more of a Blizzard problem, not an Ashran problem. Um... The, uh, so I was looking at the starting zones, and I was thinking about the cataclysm and which which the zones were affected. Um, one, Duskwood was like completely untouched, which is kind of ridiculous. And another one that's just a bigger bigger head scratcher is Elwyn Forest, right? Okay, yeah, Sh Northshire, it's on fire from the Blackrock Clan. But it's it's virtually untouched besides the starting zone, and it's kind of just weird considering the fact that Deathwing was like literally just took a poop on Stormwind, and yet Elwind is fine. I'm, don't die! Don't die! I'm dead. Fucking two health. Two health.
They said to play Paladin Druid or some other stupid class I don't want to play. Don't want to play those classes. I thought Frost would be good. Because Frost provides a lot of survivability. Not at low levels. I wish my freaking... Whatchamacallit calls it had a taunt. My water elemental had a taunt, but beggars can't be choosers. And the reason I don't play Druid is while well, I already have max eighty uh, level not max level level eighty seven Druid on Panishan, so I've already leveled a Druid. I don't like re leveling classes I've already leveled. And I don't want to play a Paladin because Paladins are stupid. And I already have a hunter. And I'm getting bored of hunters, so and there he is. Smug little bastard. So we're gonna go here. Probably get attacked while I'm trying to get all my shit back together. Exit our life staff. I want one of those. I want one of those when I trans on. And then I was also thinking, since they did, Ashran did such a great job, um, with the balancing, with the balance squishing, I should say, the squishing of the stats for all the mobs, I just realized it's probably just going to be a bitch to, um, get my transmog gear, and I love transmogging stuff. So I'm going to either have to pick, like, some low-level shit to get my transmog gear off of, which I'm totally fine with, I could do that, but I'm just, why did I do this? I'm so dead. I'm so stupid. This game sucks. Why do you guys want me to play this? Let me ice flow. Check this out. Oh, moving. I'm dead. I'm dead. This game sucks. This game... I hate... You know how I said every, everybody wants vanilla? Everybody wants vanilla, right? Every, oh, vanilla was so much better. Vanilla, it was the best. Vanilla was awesome. Everything was good in vanilla. That's when the prime time of World of Warcraft was, was in vanilla. This is fucking vanilla right here. I'm playing vanilla in 2014 when I'm not supposed to be playing vanilla. Like, I just want to go into a leveling zone for just one to two hit mobs, collect my quests, and then just level up to max up. And then go AFK in Stormwind or just fly around doing nothing. I don't want to get my ass beat by freaking stupid mobs. And then I'm going to get to level 100, and then there's nothing to do at level 100, and I'm dead again. God damn, I'm just running. I'm just running. I'm ranting. I'm ranting and running right now. Oh, God. Getting sandwiched on, in on all fronts. All right. We're going to go here. We're going to go all the way up here. I'm going to eat my lollipop and drink my melon juice. Yeah, I'm gonna get to. Oh yeah, I was saying I was gonna get to Ashran. Well, I'm on Ashran. Ashran doesn't exist. The PvP zone in Ashran. Ashran is not available in Ashran. And then I'm gonna go get to level 100. Grind my way. The more I play this, the more I'm not looking forward to level 80 to 90. This one, Cataclysm, based on Pandashan, was completely broken. Pandashan, <laughs> Cataclysm, based on Ashranashan, is going to be 400 times more broken, because I'm just going to get my ass beat. Then 85 to 90. Mostly a huge just grinding fest grinding five levels because they never fought, they never bothered to work on the questing system. Then I'm gonna have to grind through that. And I've heard there's been reports on CNN that mobs up in Pandaria just one hit you. Like they don't give they have no respect for you. They just one hit you. So that's always great. Why am I attacking these mobs at sixty eight percent? You know why? Because I'm so used to being like, oh I could just deal with this real quick. And then I just nope. No, get away. What am I doing? Oh my god, that wolf was beating the fuck out of me. I need food. I never carry food. You know why? Because you don't need to. I need to kill the skunk so I can get out of combat. Piece of shit. 
Ugh. Game's so gross. Wait, look at my gear. Nothing. You know why? Because quests that give me good gear are broken. I need I need my heirloom weapon and elemental force and just run around and one hit everything. That's what I need. Get off the stupid plates. You're frozen in place. How'd you charge? Yeah, we leveled up. Oh, I got Ice Lance. What did it replace? The Fire Blast. Okay. Now we can get some freaking wom wombo combos. Ready? First aggro him. Boom! Boom. We're doing mad damn. The mad deeps. Now I, have a, now I have a good spell to run away when I'm about to die and I can still spam. Yes, we got shoulders. Wait. We got, yeah, we got shoulders. Check it out. Check it out. All right, stay away from the spiders. Let's mount up. We got we broke one k health. We're in we're in the Mile High Club. Boom! Why didn't you do your freeze thing? The world may never know. Oh, geez, we're dead. GG. Look at this shit. This sucks. I should have polymorphed him. Checking out ice flows. Yeah, that's right. I I can only my fingers only range out of um. Oh yes. My fingers only range from the one to three keys. That's sweet. Um, we used um. I guess I accidentally used the method in my Zandalari Warbringer technique that I also posted. Um, this guy, I have to like run out of range so he disappears and then I can resummon him. So we're gonna try to so no no, we're only at sixty eight percent health. This is this is the Ashran experience right here. From being turned into a complete casual never mind, scratch that. I was never hardcore when it came to this game. So a complete casual gamer like that just comes into this comes into being like weaned on Cataclysm and Pandaria where you don't have to do anything and you get to level 90 turned into this dog eats dog world where I'm getting hit for 152 by a wolf that I'm one level higher than I can sell my water elemental again apparently Tokyo Hotel is coming to the Netherlands I don't know who Tokyo Hotel is. And I'm pretty sure Tokyo is spelled with a Y, you idiot. Check this out. Mad place. I should really coin that with um, Ice Lands instead of Frostbolt. But yeah, I've been uh, trucking along. Spent like four hours playing yesterday, getting to level 21. Level I went from level 5 to 21. No, level 5 to, yeah, 21, 21. I just suffered from raise, rabies. Aggro him. Boom, boom. Dead. Nope, nope. I'm trying, guys. I'm trying my best. Wait, there's going to... Here, here comes the next comment, next wave of comments. Like, see, I'm using using the freaking stupid keybinds, key which are completely useless and only serve a purpose if you're doing professional game, like if you're going into like arena tournaments for money or something. Because you could totally raid, and I can guarantee I've raided before in retail, topping my DPS chart, clicking. Like it's. I think people overreact when it comes to clicking. Like, it's stupid. See, like, now I'm keyboard turning. Like, I could do all of these keybinds and keyboard turn when I'm just running like this, and people will be like, oh my god, freaking keyboard turner, you're stupid. 
You're so dumb and stupid. Yeah, anyway, um... So, then I saw... There's another comment. Not This isn't a hate comment or anything. It was about how to install the game. So, if you manage to watch through 15 minutes of ranting and me dying, then I guess I can explain how to actually play on this vanilla world of... <laughs> War Warlords of Vanilla Private Server. Um, you go to first thing you want to do is go to the World of Warcraft website, and this. Oh my god! Oh my god! Sorry, let me get out of this fray. Uh, uh, leave me alone. Thank you. Okay, so you want to go to the World of Warcraft website. Don't go to battle.net. I tried to do it through battle.net before. Like, I tried to... I forgot what I tried to do. Oh, yeah, I was trying to do some machinima-type things, and you can't use, like, this one tool with the... With the, um private servers because they don't make like a background process so I had to do it through retail and that's why I made it yeah don't make a Battle.net account and then try to get World of Warcraft through that because it's stupid and it's dumb and it doesn't work half the time or at least I had trouble with it what you want to do is just go to World of Warcraft's website it's th on the front page there's probably something about play to level 20 for free and then you sign up for that then you download World of Warcraft they give you what you need they give you 6.03 and then you go to Ashran, Ashran's website, you go download. What can I do for you? For okay, I was reading the question. You go download their launcher, then you go to wherever you installed it, wherever you installed World of Warcraft, and then you just plop that in its directory. So, for example... So, for example... Um, where I put my launcher is in C drive, program files, by 86, times 86, whatever that stupid thing is, and then World of Warcraft. And then you just plop it right in your World of Warcraft folder, then you um, then you just run it. And then the launcher pops up, you hit play, you wait a little bit because it takes a while to boot up, and then you're playing, you're on Ashran. So yeah, I mean that's that. Uh, there is like, there is a confusion. I guess they're cr they're creating a confusion on their serv own servers. Um, I know when you go, when you sign up and it tells you how to connect it first. It says to do what you did with Pandashan and just place it in a um, in a folder, and then it loads it whatever for you. Um, I tried that. It like didn't do anything. Like it said it was doing something, but it wasn't doing anything. I knew there was a quest that... Please don't need it. Oh, I could use that. Oh, I could use that. Okay. I got a plan. We're gonna get this... We're gonna get this stupid letters. Stupid letters. I'm gonna bait them. Probably die. Okay, I'm gonna bait them. Right. Here's the plan, guys. 95%. 3,596 3, XP rested. We're going to avoid these stupid spiders. We're going to head straight for the camp. Avoid the stupid charging worgen that knock you off your mount. Head straight for the camp. It's pouring rain. Oh, God. We're dead. Oh, God. No, no, no. Bail. Just bail. No, no. Because I'm going to run in there and aggro more of them. Okay, we're fighting our way through, I guess. Get the heck out. These guys piss me off. I hate Worgen. Stupid addition to the game. They should never be a playable race. They're so dumb. Their run right their their run cycle's stupid. They're they're all stupid. Stupid. Cool models though, but they're stupid. Leveled up. We got teleport. Instantly teleport. To any major city. Wow. Instant. Because taking a 10 second cast was too long. See? 
Breeding for the casuals. He's just going to charge. Nope. Oh, fingers of frost. Beautiful. Beautiful DPS work. Beautiful burst right there. Got a healing potion. I should use those. Yeah, I could have saved my life like 40 times. All going to hot bar. Okay. You guys see it? Let's get our binoculars out. There it is. Son of a bitch. Yeah, tank him. Tank. Alright, see ya. Peace. No, we're well fed. Our stamina won't be increased by two. Forever. Alright, yeah. So that's how you play on this. I've, I've covered that. Covered my rant. Um, Konami, coming out of the woodworks, making, uh, a horror game. I mean, yeah, I might play that. kind of want to play it. It's a Konami horror game. How could you not play it? Yeah, I, I don't know. What game, I don't even know what games Konami has made recently. Is this game, Co yeah, that's Konami. Silent Hill HD Remix. Okay, yeah, that's Konami, yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah, okay, I was double checking. What? Um, I've also heard, also gained wind that, um, uh, they're make, if remaking the Resident Evil 1 re remake of the Resident Evil 1, the, okay, I was gonna make it sound like a ridiculous thing, but I didn't, failed horribly. They're remaking the GameCube version of the Resident Evil, which was a remake of the first Resident Evil for PlayStation, which is pretty pretty cool. I mean, it's cool. Um, one good thing, one godsend is they're not making it. They're making it like the good ones, the good Resident Evils. Shout out to Resident Evil One through Three and anything, any other Resident Evils with the uh, still cameras, because those are the best. Fixed cameras. Survival Horror, Resident Evil, Silent Hill, any other, any other survival horror game with uh, static cameras, fixed cameras was the best. They're the best. Now, like, if you want my opinion on Resident Evil 4, aka, wow, this was the best Resident Evil to ever do Resident Evil, I've heard that before, which is completely farcical, ridiculous. I hate Resident Evil 4. I don't like it. It's terrible, um, not because you had to escort a little bitch around that, like, died every two seconds. It was because... English. It's because I hate the camera style. I hate that combat style. It, it became more of a, hey, let's go just shoot things that aren't zombies because it's fun. Really, there's no puzzles. Like, the puzzles was the cool stuff. I love the puzzles. Like, and that's why, like, Resident Evil are, like, that's why I feel like all the Resident Evils started to suck after that, because they just turned into shooters. Like, monster shooters, and that's, like, yeah, it's okay, but, like, Resident Evil 1 through 3, even Silent Hill suffered from it, like, Silent Hill 4, The Room, like, sure, Silent Hill 4 was creepy as fuck, but, like, all it was was combat. It really took out everything else. But then again, they didn't do the same thing as Resident Evil did. I guess Silent Hill. I like Silent Hill 4. I mean, it, it kind of sucked because it was more focused on combat and shit, but it was pretty good still. Now we're going to get our ass. This is, where, this is where it gets deadly. Oh, that burst, though. Beautiful. I... I think I should just go to arenas right when I hit level 100 because I already, I already know how to play. Um, like, I could just do this and kill them. Boom. They're dead. Great. Now they're just leaning around toxic clouds for me to die in. Toxic clouds are deadly. I missed that. I know I missed it. You don't have to, you don't have to say it kill that cockroach because 
that's another thing. That's, that's why I think, like, a lot of people get stuck in combat. Like, sometimes there's just literally the combat bug where you're, there's nothing in sight and you're in combat. But, like, sometimes, like, if you do an AoE, like, out here and then you accidentally hit, I better get out of this before I die. Like, you accidentally hit, like, a squirrel or something and the squirrel doesn't die. As you saw there, I didn't die. Um, and you get stuck in combat and you're going to have a bad time. So make sure, especially if you're outside, like, go around, make sure you didn't hit any little creatures. Oh, dude, aggro. Yes. Good work, good work. Yo, thanks. <laughs> Ruthless. Ruthless. I can't. It's dog, it's doggy dog. Should have saved that for oh 960 going towards that hundred k crit for us when he just op nerf them. Pew, pew, pew. Pew, pew. This is where frost mages become fun. Ooh, I'll take that. Just to have it, and I am tailoring. Yeah, I did pick up tailoring. Um, I picked up tailoring. I was gonna do something fun like engineering, but you can't do you can't have fun in vanilla. And this is vanilla. You can't have fun. You have to do what benefits you. And you're dead. Good. I love this now. Frost Mage is OP. Mobs OP. Run into a rare. That's like a. That's like a boss. It's a raid fight. It's a, you're in a dungeon right now. You run into a rare out here. You're fighting. You're fighting a dungeon boss. Find dungeon elites if you run into a rare. Now we have to wait. Hang on. Where are they? Who should be? Okay, this is. Is there a quest for these things yet? I feel like those. I don't want to be up here yet. I'll help you. Oh, you got it. I feel like I have to. There's a quest to collect these things because there's a bunch of them scattered on the ground. I'm gonna go turn in the rotting one first. This this one, the Night Watch, and then maybe they'll give me something to go kill these guys in the graveyard. Hi. Stupid spider. Tupac is alive. Oh my god. Yeah, Tupac is alive. That was my H key, if you heard that. My H key is weirdly sticky. There it is. And then this... I was looking through some of the stuff yesterday. Um, kind of casual. It's not... Whoa, strong box. Whoa. Well, I'm not going to get anything from the strong boxes because Alliance always loses. Well met. Ooh, those are some shoulders. There we go. See, five skeletal warriors, five skeletal mage. Have a good one. Told you. I know this game like the back of my hand. And I think Dead is going to wrap it up for today. Ooh. Damn. Yeah, that's, this is going to wrap it up for today. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Warlords of Vanilla. That's This is the new name until they fix it. It's officially Warlords of Vanilla. Someone's already leveling another alt. You're cool. Thumbs up for you. And yeah, I hope you guys have a great day. If you're going to bed after this, have a good sleep. Have a good slumber. And um, yeah, I'm out of here. Peace.